by the way. Um, how have you? How has your stay been here in the Hotel Corral? Have, has everyone been treating you all right? <laughs> yeah, I, I love coming here to the Hotel Corral. Yeah. I've been staying here for a long time, and I can honestly say it's my favorite hotel in the world. What can you say about, I don't know, the waves? How's Totos been for you? Totos was amazing yesterday. We had really big waves, about 30 to 40 feet yesterday. Wow. So it was the biggest very good day there in many years. Mm -hmm. And I had a really good surf out there and got a lot of big ones. And All right. And yeah, I, I, I really love being able to come here to the corral, go out to the island, come back in and you know, just be comfortable, go in the jacuzzi, have good food. It's yeah. It's a place that a lot of the, the professional surfers that I travel with really love to come stay and always look forward to coming to Ensenada because of it. Down here in Baja, what would you say to people that are kind of scared of coming down to Baja with everything that you get to experience? I would say you're just as more likely to come into problems in Los Angeles than you are here. Yeah. I've been coming here for a long time and I know that there is, you know, have been some more crime in the border regions, but I think as a tourist, you know, as long as you're not flashing money around, it's it's pretty okay. It's fine? Yeah, it's fine. I, I never get nervous about coming here. Yep. I, I have nothing but good experiences every time I come here. <laughs> and going back to Killers, the wave that you had, you know, have experienced, you've been coming down here to Ensenada for many years. How important would you think is Killers in this big circuit of big wave? Killers is very important. It's one of the, the three main big waves in the United States. Well, maybe there's a few there's a few more in Hawaii, but really you've got Killers, Waimea Bay in Hawaii, and Mavericks mm -hmm. in San Francisco. And those are regarded as the three premier big wave spots to, to paddle in, in, in the world. So it's there's there's a huge history out at this place and it gets some of the biggest waves in the world. Yeah, so, well, in Sonata here, we have one of the coolest waves in the world. That's good to know, right? Yeah. So, um, what are your next plans, like your, your future, your career? What are you planning to do in the near future? I'm planning on going to Hawaii in the new, near future and over to Europe. I go to Ireland almost every year and the island of Madeira, okay. off the coast of Portugal. So, in the next two months, that's what I'll be doing. Mm -hmm. as well as coming back down to Baja and surfing more. All right. I love surfing Baja in January. Getting ready for the Peligroso? Yeah, getting ready for the Peligroso, yeah. Yeah, hopefully we get a, a big day for it. I know um, they just quite, weren't quite ready to run it this, this time. This but, time? Yeah. All right, but there's going to be much more waves to enjoy here in Baja, right? I'm sure there will, yeah. All right, well, what else can you tell us about, you know, the, what you have been doing here in Ensenada? Well, I've been I've been relaxing here at the hotel and surfing all the waves around and eating good food, good and, um, food. at the taco stands and just having a good time. I, I really love coming down here and I'm gonna you know tomorrow will be five days that I've been here to stay and and it's really it's one of my favorite places in the world. Great. So. All right. Well, thank you so much for being here, yeah, and um, nice we'll be seeing you later here down in Baja. Yeah, yeah. You'll see me again soon here. Awesome. <laughs>